BK3 Alpha Charlie Azulu portable. It's calling CQ, CQ, CQ. The BK3 ACC portable in Victoria's High Country. It's calling CQ, Kansas, CQ. The BK3 Alpha Charlie Azulu portable. It's calling CQ, CQ. Okay. Hi guys. This is Jim. We go three AMN. We're at the Sherbrooke Community Radio Camp, and uh, we've still got the uh, wear the face masks uh, rule in Victoria. And uh, so the guys around the camp have been pretty good wearing the face masks. Although there were a lot of campers here over the weekend, and they they failed to wear the face masks. Now I'm actually drinking a cup of coffee now, and it's very very hard to drink a coffee through the face mask. So that's the reason the face mask is not on. Now this is the typical uh, camp, radio camp that the club has and uh, misfortunately I don't know how many people go camping in their lifetime but we always leave something home don't we? I guarantee we'll leave it home and uh, I left Flicky at home this time which is the little arborist tool that I used to get over the top of the trees for the antennas so misfortunately our antennas are only about 10-12 uh, metres, probably 13-14 metres up off the ground which is not as high as we normally stick them up. But uh, let me introduce the uh, the area over this side, that's Volker, VK3DDR. He's got his electronic digital stuff set up. He's using a G5RV, which is a uh, mighty fine junk one, MFJ one. And uh, it's hanging across in that direction. Peter over here, he's got the uh, VK3 ACZ. And um, he's got... Uh, Usually been been using my G5, and uh, F44 has decided to talk, so I'll shut her up. Tina, please. And uh, he's been using that one, and it's the first time he's been out in the bush with a radio, away from Melbourne, away from the metropolitan area with all the electronic noises. And uh, we couldn't get him off the radio yesterday, so <coughs> he's running on battery. So I took a hundred, a 200 watt solar panel across and a regulator across for him. And, hooked it onto the battery and he suddenly found out that he could stay on air all day with the sunshine. So he worked the radio flat out yesterday, which is really good. My camp is right behind me here, my typical old camp. This time I've got the uh, tent set up next door to the camp and uh, because I've got the tent set up next door to the camp, I've got the, it's a four man tent. I've got the table inside with the 746 uh, sitting on the bench to use the generator over the paddock over here so we can run a bit of power during the day and charge everyone's batteries but uh, it's been another generally good camp excepting for the weekend when there were so many people driving back and forth on the road creating a bit of dust and uh, I think anybody knows with solar panels um, dust can be a real big problem and uh, I have a little dog here wants to be in the scene come on come on come on <laughs> come on come on you can do it you know that come on Okay, now I've got a little dog in the scene, which makes her happy, and I've got my coffee. But uh, as the day or the next couple of days progress, uh, what I'll do is I'll go over and uh, video the guys playing with their radios and, and uh, whatever mode and so forth they're doing. And oh, that's who I find. Greg's out the back here too. Greg's here, so we got uh, uh, one, two, three, four, two, three, four. Oh, we've got five of us here at this camp. A couple of the guys couldn't come because it was so sudden after the lockdown. But uh, we are having an absolute ball here. And uh, we're just sitting around quietly, playing radio, yakking, etc., etc., like we normally do. And we're just generally enjoying the, the bush. And we're also generally enjoying the quietness of away from the city on, on uh, HF Radio. Uh, Peter here has been working quite a few countries yesterday. And uh, he's thrilled to bits about it. Volker already came up last night, or yesterday, late, late yesterday afternoon. We got him set up, but he hasn't played radio yet, but he'll get stuck into it today. And uh, later on this morning, I'll be on the uh, normal net on 80 metres that I'm always on, on a Tuesday. And uh, during the day, I may, I may or may not uh, get serious and play some fruit and play some stuff during the day. But uh, that's it for me now. And... Uh, Hope to either catch you on the air or see you out in the bush somewhere. And uh, amateur radio is all about hams helping hams. It's not about I'm better than you or I know this. 
I'm so great. This fortunately, which is coming out of a lot of the clubs, and a lot of your endos come out of a lot of people who have very ignorance. And they don't know about anything, and um, they're always quick to judge. That's why we're a small club. We do not have those people in our club. Any one of those that turn up, they don't last very long, I can tell you. So, Hams Helping Hams, Sherbrooke Community Radio Club, Bush Camp again, with VK3F Woof Woof sitting on my lap here, and uh, generally loves camping. She gets to listen to all the sounds and the new scents and so forth. So, we have radio dog friendly camps. Okay, guys, I'll catch you later on. And uh, if we're lucky, we're not going to get any rain today although you never know, and uh, we'll be able to play some more radio. So this is VK3 AMN signing off on the Sherbrooke Community Radio Camp, VK3 KID, and have a look at our web page, and you will find the video that I made up from this camp up there within about a month's time from now. And uh, from now, it's the first week of being let out from Victoria, lockdown. OK, guys, have fun, and uh, I'm going to go back to doing my bird watching. Cheers, everyone.